Hi there guys, I'm Chris Bowden. Welcome to today's Captain's Blog. It is Thursday, October 27th at 1229 hours and I'm here with my buddy Brick. How you doing? From Iskar. And we've got the whole video team here and we're on set doing more awesome Haas educational videos here where we're going to start with tramming advice. So you guys stay tuned. There's going to be, we're doing like a lot of video production. It's going to be at least six, eight hours here on the set of actually rolling cameras, shooting video. It's going to be a whole thing. And this is the continuation of our Haas series. So stay tuned and I'll have more as it happens. Linus, I got the message. I'm not going to approve any of your comments. You've done like 50 comments. I'm not going to approve comments that are made by you that are just pimping your channel on mine. Doesn't work that way. Do something cool, send me a recommendation, I'll do it. But if you just keep commenting with, hey, you're into tubes, oh my god, you're into tubes, you're cool as a girl, oh my god, you're into tubes, ah! I'm not going to do that. It's not going to fly. Sorry, man. Okay, so it's 10, it'll be bigger. Uh, let's take this out of here. Zero, F1, yes. Okay. All right. Uh, position, let's go distance to go. Operator, G54, machine, distance to go. Okay. All right, I think I'm ready. We're good? Yeah. All right, so we're gonna make a video. Yeah. All right, this is like, what video one? This is like third one we've done so far? Yeah. All right, this is our third video. It's our third video, it's 1359 hours and we're rocking out. The next one's gonna be, how to make keys, positioning keys, for your Parlec vise to fit a Haas TM1 milling machine. 1, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. 150, 150 thou cut. All right, and the X and uh, here we go. All right, you ready? Uh, yeah, hit me. Okay, here we go. It's 150 thousandths of an inch cut on a Haas tool TM1 room one nope. tool room mill using an Iskar, what is it? An Iskar T490. That's beautiful. Nope. And it was effortless, it was nothing. Nope. And? And it's totally cool. Yeah, totally cool. We're cool. Wow, that's awesome. Yep. Look at those chips. Look at those beautiful blue chips. Yep. Multicolor, and uh, there's, our, there's our kick over burr, so we're going to hit this with a file, and uh, we're ready to go. Beautiful. Hey there guys, it's 1748 hours. I've been hanging out with my very good friend Rick here all day long. We've been just having a ton of fun. Yeah. This is this has this been is great. Good stuff. And here's everything you need to know about surface footage per minute. Okay, right there. There's there's your formulas for those of you following at home. Okay, the magic formula is 3.82 times your surface feet per minute divided by the diameter of your tool. Okay, that's what you need to know. So that equals the RPM. Really, that equals the RPM. You know yeah. What you really, really need to know what? What kind of metal you're cutting? Yeah, that helps. Well, well, yeah, you need to know that so you can compute for. Yeah, but it's right. it's a whole thing. It's a whole thing, and you're gonna learn all about it in an upcoming video here at the Geek Group. So yeah, but and today, and always, our tooling is provided by Iscom. So you gotta, I gotta take you upstairs and show you the animation. Okay, I'd love oh, you to see it. Yeah. Is it. Good stuff. Yeah, it's we got we've got an Iskar specific animation that okay. we did just for you guys. It's all original content. We all did right. our own Haas. We did our own Iskar. It's all for you guys. Oh, I can't wait to see that. Cool. We'll you take you upstairs and show you. Steve right. did it. That gentleman right there. Steve, you did it. all the logo animations, and then he did all the ones for the safety stuff. All right. That's that's Steve. Hi, Steve. Okay, and that's Jabroni. Jabroni. Okay. Jabroni. Is that his real name? Who's also Steve? No, his real name is Bellatini. But nobody could remember that, so we call him Jabroni. Jabroni. Yeah. Okay. And then we learned, like, after calling the poor guy Jabroni for like two months, we learned that that's actually an Italian swear word. It's so, not an Italian swear word. What is it? it it's, it's a uh, Philadelphia swear word. It's a Philadelphia swear well, Jabroni speaks fluent Italian. Screw no. Philly. Well, he's. <laughs> so, while you guys were shooting, we were standing up there watching Jabroni, and while you guys were doing the math up there, he just gained more Gabe. So it started off. <laughs> I just wanted to stand back there with a box of raisins and try and... <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna kill this horse. You're gonna break him! Don't, 
Don't break jabroni. It was hilarious. I don't know why we're laughing at it. Steve, we know exactly what was going through his head at that time. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's... <laughs> if you're a machinist, though, this is like porn. But if you're not a machinist, this is boring as hell. It's it, and I'm having a blast. I'm like, this is cool, isn't it? I'm learning. We're talking about Iconel. But if you're not a machinist and you don't know what Inconel is, man, this is just. We so. couldn't hear a damn thing that was going on down here. Well, this but is on the live there, stream. Well, it wasn't. Oh, up there. you guys are just sitting up there He's laughing your ass off. Yeah. <laughs> Because he was off screen, off the live screen, li the, okay. the live stream, he was off to the shot. Okay. And... What? You're going to get shot one of these things. You're just, I'm, just, I'm not even going to think. I'm just going to crack you in the nose when you do that. I, <laughs> I'm just waiting for you to stand there and go. Um, I'm still, I'm waiting. <laughs> I'm going back to work. Time is 1939 hours, and just while we were screwing around, we made these, which are the replacement sleeve for this. So now we can hang our big, awesome red ring of science, and we're gonna do some cool set thing with that. I don't really know what, but that's the day. It was it was a whole day on the set making videos, making Haas educational videos, and it was a lot of fun. And we did stuff here on the big main set with the whiteboard. We did most, almost everything we did was on a lathe. It was, it was a whole day, or on a mill, sorry, on a mill. We did a little bit on a lathe. We played, look at that. We got some really cool thread. That's, uh, I think, four TPI, four threads per inch. Might be three, it's three or four. But whole day making chips, made a lot of pre-chips, and Moose is taking the leftover chips, these really pretty blue chips, and she's casting them over here in epoxy and making them into jewelry. It's, it's kind of cool. It's gonna be a whole thing. And you'll be able to get these through Moose's art thing. She's got like, she's got an Etsy account and stuff like that. I don't know, you'll find it. Uh, if anybody has any questions, just comment and I'll post a link and stuff. And you can get that stuff. And then that's how Moose gets money for her wood stuff. That's, that's how she funds her stuff. So, yeah, that's the day. You guys have fun. I'm Chris Bowden. Thank you for watching today's Captain's Blog, and I'll see you tomorrow. See you.